Amen. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. It's time to gather. The, glory to God. The events that took place on the earth today and in the past week. Hallelujah. You know it's time to gather. Somebody bless the Lord. Somebody praise his name. There, there are seven, I'm just going to point out a few things. There are seven major events or happenings on the earth that prove to us that, listen, it's not the same. And it's time to gather. Somebody praise God. And today alone, a massive 30 feet, 10 ton meteorite exploded in central Russia at 30,000 miles per hour. Or 33, correction, 33,000 miles per hour. That has never happened before. Come on, somebody bless the Lord. Somebody praise his name. Injuring over 1,200 people affected an era with over 1 million damaging hundreds of buildings shattering windows damaging um, sending shock waves for miles sending um, a, wi a white streak in the sky for over 125 miles this thing in Russia was major to thousands of people rush in the street I mean in Russia is very freezing cold some of us a lot and when this meteorite hit thousands of people were were in the street there was just confusion and panic and the, the biggest question of all is that there was no warning there was no warning from NASA. There was no warning from the Russian scientists. There was no warning from the astrophysicists. There was no warning from the Russian military. But there was warning in church. Come on, somebody. Somebody give God a praise. There was warning in church that something is going to happen in the cosmos. Come on, somebody. That God is going to use the things. Hallelujah. And speak. Somebody praise his name. Glory to God. Hallelujah. God was given the warning somebody praise the lord hallelujah glory to god the explosion was so fierce hallelujah that the shock waves went for miles and and a lot hundreds of buildings were damaged it left a deep crater in the ground come on somebody this thing was major and just a few hours ago hallelujah and, and more meteorites exploded in cuba the earth is not in a good state right now Someone bless the Lord. Come on, the earth is not in a good state. God said, listen, you're not going to listen to the church. You're not going to listen to the preachers. So I'm going to use, hallelujah, the celestial objects and they're going to speak. Come on, somebody. Somebody give God a praise. They are saying that they have never heard and seen it like this before. Somebody praise his name. Hallelujah. Number three today alone, an asteroid called DA-14. 165 feet in diameter past earth the closest in history in earth's history the asteroid never come so close to planet earth ever somebody say ever and many scientists believe that it's connected to the the, the, the shower of meteorites in Russia and Cuba an asteroid let me just leave this bit of information with you an asteroid can destroy an entire country It can destroy the earth and it passed earth the closest ever. The, the, the NASA, they were watching it so closely. And even though you think this is far, it's 17,000 miles from earth, but that's pretty close. An asteroid can destroy an entire city in the US. An asteroid can destroy an entire island. And it passed earth the closest today. Come on, somebody. Someone said the answer is to gather. In the past 24 hours, same place in Russia, there was a massive mega quake of 7.3 right there in Russia. Come on. Somebody said gather. In the past week, in the Santa Cruz Island, the earth have never experienced so much earthquake in one spot. Come on. Never. Come on, somebody. It, it, it moved from mega earthquake to mega earth split. One spot. 8 .0, 7.0, 7.1, 7.0, 6.8, 6.5, over 200 aftershocks. Come on, somebody. Somebody said the answer is to gather. Hallelujah. Just a few days ago, hallelujah, a massive solar explosion took place on the sun. 
and it sent fire flares particles 1.8 million miles per hour towards the earth i'm just talking this is like just in one week you know so while things is happening on the sun, happening with meteorites, happening with asteroids, happening with earthquake, come on somebody, come on, hallelujah, all these things are just happening in one moment, come on, this is not regular, God is sending a message to mankind, come on somebody, God is sending a message to mankind, it's just a few weeks ago we saw where the waters turned blood in Australia, come on somebody in Russia, in Ukraine, in Sri Lanka, in India, in France, in Lebanon, in the US and we said these waters is a sign that distress is going to come upon the earth go to God, church of God God is saying with all these things happening there is no expert to give an answer but God's church have the answer can you stand on your feet somebody God is saying church of God it's time to gather gather them in the house of God God uh, over this weekend like you have never before uh, come on somebody uh, the asteroids are speaking uh, the meteorites speaking uh, the, the blood sea speaking the blood lake speaking uh, the earthquake speaking uh, the earth split speaking come on somebody uh, somebody said the answer is together it's happening right before our eyes come on somebody like we have never seen it before. I just leave this verse with you and we close in Luke 21, verse 25. He said, There shall be signs in the sun and in the moon and in the stars upon the earth, distress of nations with perplexity, the seas and the waves roaring. Somebody said, The answer is together. Come on, somebody. I, I needed to hear it stronger from you. Somebody said the answer, the answer is together. The earth right now is terrified. It's terrified. But the church got to gather them in. Somebody praise God. Are you going to take this thing serious till tonight? Somebody praise his name. Are you going to take it serious? Hallelujah. Glory to God. We just want to encourage everyone.